All right, so here's how you print the uh, CD or DVD uh, using the Epson P50 printer. <clears throat> There's a um, Epson print CD uh, application or program in the computer. So I put my design to be printed out. And uh, now what I do to best the printer is ready to print. So all you have to do is open it up uh, that's the uh, tray where the prints come out so you need to take that out just lift it up and take it out and here's the icon of uh, CD so we have to put it in the upper shirt so now the printer prepares uh, itself for printing the CD. Now that's the uh, CD printing tray where you have to place the CD or DVD whatever. Okay. There's an arrow on the side. There's another arrow over here. You just slide it in. And now you can see, feel some resistance, but that's the uh, printer rolls, so you have to push it in until the two arrows align, more or less like that. It doesn't have to be perfect because the printer is going to uh, search for the CD anyway for uh, better than lines, quicker it prints. Well, basically that's it, it's ready, so uh, all you do is just uh, click print, uh, confirm the, uh, the printer, I will make it uh, a bit lighter than it was originally, because I, I like the way it is. I like when it's more like watermark than a real print. I'm talking about the photograph. And you print, uh, you click print. Uh, it, oh, sometimes, it, well, when you set the, uh, the in, in, inner diameter of the disc uh, smaller than 43 millimeters, it uh, says uh, that there's a warning that you have to let the city to dry more than 24 hours because of the uh, small diameter it doesn't make a difference anyway because I burn all the cities before I print them well yeah now it will start to print yeah, it's aligning the disc and it will start printing on it. Yeah, now it prints. I'm not going to speed it up so you can see that it actually prints in real time. Quite quick too, be honest. Yeah, you can already see the, uh, the disc coming out. Mm, there we go.
Alright, so as you can see, the print is working great. Uh, I can show you the prints. I'm not going to use big sheets, but I'm going to use one of my. Followed by six inch. Now to do uh, the paper prints, just take the. Oh, I already did. Have I? Yeah. Well, if you want to make ordinary prints, just take that slot, that that tray out of that slot, and put it in a lower slot, a uh, lower slot where it goes down. Paper, I think. Simple as that. And then just. Um, take whatever photos I say it was a photograph of me it's relatively low resolution because it's the uh, the online version doesn't matter that much anyway I'll put it in Photoshop because that gives me and the best color control. Alright. No. Okay. Print. I have to set it to Epson P50 series. And now we have to set it to see that's how much uh, inks you've got. So I suppose you're gonna need to replace a yellow, black, and the others, but well, still plenty. Um, four by six inch. ICM, alright, okay, uh, alright, we're going to print it small, so it's got proper resolution, uh, 20%, no, 50% should do, and you just press print, see what happens. You want super quality, you have to uh, turn the high speed off, then it prints slowly, but just perfect. Here I am coming out, so I'm going to take this for a second. So, uh, there we go. That's the photograph of me. Alright. Doesn't look that bad to be honest. Still got better quality than the uh, lab photographs. Alright, well, I believe that's it, and I'll just show you what day it is today. Let's Google we type to day. Date today's date, enter 
Friday, 19th of May, 2017. Dating Seahawks UK, that is where I live. I just show you the icon, we are online, so it's the hoax or anything like that. And um, thanks for your purchase. Hopefully, you will receive the printer untouched. Alright, uh, take care, guys. Ta -da.